another beer video coming. Have a look out. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to my living room, welcome to another Oktoberfest beer video. The last time I had the Spaten beer, this time I do have the Hacker Pschor, another brewery here in Munich, one of the six big breweries that sent their beer to the Oktoberfest. There are more breweries, more small ones, but only these six breweries, that's Hacker Pschor, that's Spaten, Löwenbräu, Palana, Hofbräuhaus and Augustina, these six are allowed to sell beer at the Oktoberfest. And they all produce the beer in advance, of course. I already tried the Spaten. The Oktoberfest beer was fantastic. Today, let's have a look at the Hakab Shaw. And I made a huge mistake the last time that I poured the Oktoberfest beer into a stain. That you couldn't see the color difference. That's why I brought two clear glasses today. This one you know already, Oktoberfest uh, 2006. And this is a beer tasting glass. But doesn't matter at all, it's only about that these glasses are both clear, so that you, that you can see the color difference between the Oktoberfest beer and the regular beer. So, let's pour some beer. I will start with the regular beer, Hackabschor Münchner Hell, into this glass. And with the Oktoberfest beer, into the other glass. And have a look at the difference in the color. The regular beer, the bright one, the blonde beer, and the amber of the Oktoberfest beer. This is a significant difference. And uh, thank you very much for the guy who commented in the last video that I should show the colors. Here are the colors of the regular beer and the Oktoberfest beer. This is a huge difference. Could be that um, the Hakabschor is especially dark, but I don't know. We will find out when the Oktoberfest opens in about a week's time. But the most important thing, now we have to try the beer. I will start with the regular beer here out of the clear glass. Prost! Yeah, Hakabschor Münchner Hell, that's a pretty good beer. Not many bad things to say. It's not as good as the Augustina, but it's definitely way superior to the Spaten regular beer I had last week. It's a good beer. It's a really good beer. Why don't I, don't I drink this stuff more often? It's good. But now the comparison, the Oktoberfest beer. Yeah, this is good as well. Can't tell you right now if it's better or worse than the Spaten. I think it's about the same in the quality and the taste of the beer. It's really malty, not that hoppy. It has a very distinct taste. It's very refreshing, very crisp. It's very good. I think I have to finish this beer. And I also have to finish the other beer, because the Hakab Schorm nicht nur hell. Yeah, this surprised me, right out of the gate, that this is really, really good. The Oktoberfest beer, yeah, is always a very good beer. Uh, this year's uh, Hakab Schorm Oktoberfest beer is very, very good as well. So the last time with the Spaten, it was no contest, it was not even close, because the Oktoberfest beer of Spaten was so much better than the regular beer. On these two, it's hard to decide. I have to be honest. That's very good. Very tasty. And the Oktoberfest beer is very good as well. Sorry to say, I cannot crown a winner this round. Both beers are excellent. The Oktoberfest beer with the, the darker note, of course, a little more malty than the regular beer, but the regular beer is excellent as well. 
So it will be a lot of fun to go into one of the two Hakkab Shaw tents this year and try this Oktoberfest beer out of the stain, out of the big glass, sit in the beer garden, have a nice uh, grilled chicken or any, any other foods that they will offer because the food at the Oktoberfest is underrated. This is absolutely restaurant quality. Last year at the, uh, the tent with the best food was the Ochsenbraterei. They had fantastic food. But all the other tents, everywhere where I ate something, it was very, very good. Combine this with a beer and you have a great day at the Oktoberfest. I don't go there all evening uh, or all night to drink. I go, normally I go at noon. I go to a beer garden, sit down, have something to eat, have a beer, walk around a little bit, maybe have another beer. And when the mass of the people arrive, I normally go away. And I will definitely do this again this year. Maybe not every day, but a lot of days. And I will definitely try all six beers. So now the comparison. If you go with Hakkab Shore, you do not go wrong. Both beers are excellent. And I'm very much looking forward to drink all these beers at the Oktoberfest once again. Okay, this will bring this beer drinking series to the end. I will not make four more videos for the four other breweries. I will wait to the real Oktoberfest to drink the beer there and enjoy it in the beer garden. So I hope you will join me at the Oktoberfest. It will start in um, five days from today. I will go there the first time, seven days from today, on a Monday at noon for the Oktoberfest ritual I just described. It will be a lot of fun and I'm very much looking for the Oktoberfest 2023. So don't forget to hit like and subscribe and we will join us at the Oktoberfest in 2023. See you there. Have a good time. Goodbye.